सो इफ यू हैव डन योर बैचलर ऑफ इंजीनियरिंग और बैचलर ऑफ टेक्नोलॉजी दैट इज बी और बी टेक इन मैकेनिकल इंजीनियरिंग और इफ यू आर अ नेवल आर्किटेक्ट ग्रेजुएट एंड इफ यू वॉन्ट टू स्विच योर करियर टू मर्चेंट नेवी देन यू हैव टू परस्यू दी जी एम ई कोर्स विच इज ग्रेजुएट मरीन इंजीनियरिंग कोर्स इट इज अ वन ईयर कोर्स एंड इन दिस वीडियो यू विल फाइंड अ डिटेल इन्फॉर्मेशन ऑन द लिस्ट ऑफ स्पॉन्सरशिप कंपनीज द फ्रिक्वेंटली आस्ट इंटरव्यू क्वेश्चन and the institutes in which you can apply to for the GME course. So hello everyone, welcome back to Marina Mishra's channel. So let's start with the video. Now uh, for the eligibility criteria, you need to have at least 50% marks in 10th or in 12th standard. You should have at least 50% marks in the final year of BE or BTEC. You should be less than 28 years of age at the time of admission. The most important thing in the eligibility criteria is you shouldn't be having more than 680 KTs in the entire course, and the entire course should have been completed in four years itself. Then coming on to the medicals, if you want any information on the medicals, that is on the on your eyesight, Ishihara test, color blindness, knock knees. then you can go to the i section i have uploaded a detailed interview on the medicals you will get all the information on the medicals on that video now coming on to the fees the fees for the gme is around 3 lakhs to 7 lakhs depending upon the institute in which you apply to now about the entrance exam there is no imct exam for the gme candidates but you have to apply for the entrance exam of each of the institutes now the syllabus for this institutes are first you have to prepare for your journal awareness you need to know about the current affairs history geography and little bit about economics then coming on to the english for english you have to prepare for your vocabulary the sentence correction small grammatical mistakes in the sentences and reading comprehension questions then coming on to the uh, journal knowledge for journal knowledge you need to know only the basic that is who is the prime minister or president of a certain country capitals currencies the various location of the seas on the map so this is enough for your journal knowledge now for the rest of the paper you need to prepare the important topics such as thermodynamics current electricity heat engines uh, electronics refrigeration and air conditioning so these are the very frequently asked topics in the entrance exam of the gmes then in the entrance exam you will be having a questions on reasoning reasoning such as analytical reasoning mathematical reasoning abstract reasoning now to get the questions on these topics you can go to the google and you can type the reasoning or the specific reasoning questions and you will get a detailed question papers on these uh, type of questions and you can solve around 10 to 12 questions and this will be more than enough now after the entrance exam there will be a question paper on the psychometric test so in the psychometric test the questions are like uh, how do you feel about yourself or how others feel about you how your relatives or your friends feel about you how do your uh, friends think about you and you will be given a certain option so the most important thing in the psychometric test is you have to be confident and the other part is the answer shouldn't be contradictory like if you think something about yourself and if your friends think something else about yourself so now this is a contradictory answer so you have to be very careful during the psychometric test now the list of institutes in which you can apply to is anglo eastern samudra institute ims goa great eastern lonavala and imi noida these are some of the good institutes in which you can apply for your gme course now these institutes if you get into these institutes you will mostly get placed in one of the companies now suppose if you want to secure your admission and if you want to get sponsorship then this is the list of the sponsorship companies willemson ship management then volem scorpio ship management dockendale v ships mitsui and campbell shipping so these these are the list of the sponsorship companies in which you can apply to and apply for the sponsorship now the next question is how do you apply for the sponsorship you can either mail to these companies and put your cv to these companies or you can either take the number from the internet and call these companies regarding your interest in merchant navy and you want to pursue gme course then these company will give you a call back or they will put you an email and now you have to reply to the email you have to do, go to the company and they will conduct a sponsorship test again in these companies they will uh, take your entrance exam and they will conduct an interview now the interview questions for the sponsorship companies and for the entrance exam of these institutes are very common and the most frequently asked questions are 
फर्स्ट डे विल आस्क यू अबाउट योर इंट्रोडक्शन टेल मी समथिंग अबाउट योर सेल्फ यू हैव टू टेल अबाउट योर बैकग्राउंड देन दे विल आस्क यू क्वेश्चन रिगार्डिंग योर फैमिली मेंबर वाई डू यू वॉन्ट टू एंटर मर्च एंड नेवी वाई डू यू वॉन्ट टू अप्लाई टू दिस पर्टिकुलर इंस्टीट्यूट और टू दी पर्टिकुलर कंपनी इन विच यू आर अप्लाइंग टू नाउ दे विल कम टू दी थियरी एंड दी प्रैक्टिकल क्वेश्चन नाउ दी थियरी क्वेश्चन विल बी मोस्टली ऑन दी डेफिनेशन ऑफ द करेंट एंड दी वोल्टेज Why does the ship float on waters? Now the other questions which they basically focus is on the IC engines, the wall timing diagrams, difference between the two-stroke and the four-stroke engine. Why does a merchant naval ship is a two-stroke engine, and why why don't they have four-stroke engines? Other topic which they specifically focus is on the pumps. What are the type of pumps? Which type of pump do we use mostly on board the ship? The working of the centrifugal pump, diagram of the centrifugal pump. So these are the questions which are frequently asked in the interviews of a GME. So friends, this was all about the GME course. Now, if you have liked the video, please do like the video, comment on it, share it among your friends. and do subscribe to the channel now if you want to have a conversation with me you can add me on instagram so all the best friends see you all on ship